Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're gonna go through some of the brand new clothing items that are now available in the Indigo Disc so you can spruce up your character in game. With the introduction of the Indigo Disc, we now have access to a bunch of new hairstyles as well as other customizable clothing in and around the Paldea region. But on top of this, you can get yourself some very special clothing items to customize your character. These are going to include some of the Team Star apparel, but there are a few things that you're going to have to do before you're able to obtain these items. Now, the first thing you're going to want to make sure that you've done before you do any of this is to complete the story of the Indigo Disc. Make sure you've seen the credits make sure you've done all of that once you've done that you'll be able to come and do the following the first place that we're going to want to head to is back to Paldea to the academy now once you come into the academy if you turn to your left into the library area and you come over to this direction and you're going to speak to these NPCs these are actually Giacomo and Eri of the team star leaders so you might not recognize them straight away as your character but you'll get into a bit of dialogue and they'll reveal who they are in their normal school clothing outfits. The basic premise of this task is that the team style members are all struggling with their studies and Giacomo has the idea that we could study them, help them out to making sure that they pass their tests. After this bit of dialogue, we end up taking a trip up to the classroom where we are also introduced to Ortega and Atticus. Again, both of these are in their regular school outfits, so you might not recognize them from the base games when you first fought against them when you were taking down Team Star. Now, this dialogue goes on for a little while, it leads us to going to find Melly, who is out in the courtyard. Again, when you come out into the courtyard, if you just turn left, she'll be by the vegetable patches. And once you talk to her, Again, in regards to tutoring the Team Star members, and then she'll end up coming back to the classroom where you'll finish up this cutscene. You do have to speak to Ortega, Atticus, and Melly individually, helping them with their questions that they're struggling with. But once you've done this, this Team Star cutscene will end even after a little a special appearance from Penny. Now, this cutscene is around 15 minutes long from start to finish, so it's not going to take you too long to be able to complete this. But once you've done it, the next step, once you come back into the entrance hall of the academy, come outside and then head over to Porto Marinada. Once you're in Porto Marinada, you want to come to the auction house and head directly through this direction. And there you will see Atticus back in his Team Star uniform. Now, Atticus will tell you that he will be holding a secret auction for some replica clothing items that he has made. And would you be interested in taking part in the auction? Now, the only thing I would say here is before you come to this part, make sure you've got a lot of polka dollars. You're going to need about 2.5 to 3 million polka dollars to be able to comfortably afford all of the items. There are eight items of clothing up in total. So that's eight auctions in total. And the items will end up costing you anywhere from between the lowest I paid was 240,000 polka dollars and the highest was 365 polka dollars the items that you're going to be able to buy from these auctions is the replica dragon gloves replica mega suit helmet the replica ball guy helmet replica aether shoe replica aqua suit helmet the replica bag the replica expansion suit helmet and the replica ultra sunglasses now in total when i complete the auction for all eight of these items like i mentioned you're going to need a lot of polka dollars it cost me 2.5 million polka dollars in total just to get these eight items so probably unless you're really really interested in getting them they're nice to have or you're a bit of a completionist maybe you can skip out on some of these items the problem is if you want the ball guy helmet you're gonna have to do the first two items anyway so that is third in the list you can't skip those you could forfeit getting those items all together and go to the ball guy helmet but of course the further you go down the list you're gonna have to kind of forego a lot of these items if you want in just the replica ultra sunglasses that are at the bottom of the list You'd have to forego everything else just to get those and they would end up costing you around 360,000 polka dollars anyway. So once you've bought that last eighth item, then Atticus has a little cutscene. He'll thank you for buying all of those replica items of clothes. And as a thanks, he will teach you the glow stick dance emote. So that is something that you get as a bonus. 
But after this, the Team Star quest for these clothing items, it has come to an end. Now, the next piece of clothing that we're going to be able to access is going to be back in the Blueberry Academy. Now, you want to head back to the entrance hall and head into the club room. Once you're in the club room, you want to speak to Drayton. He's probably speaking to Crispin at this point, and you want to start a bit of dialogue with him. He'll have a backwards and forwards with Crispin, and then he will end up sitting down at the table. Now, it's when he sat at the table, you want to go and speak to him again. You'll have another piece of dialogue with him about being the president of the Blueberry League. And after this, when you approach him once more, he'll ask you if you want to battle, and you accept the battle and go into it. And once you beat him after the battle, he will award you the black and gold tracksuit, which is the Drayton tracksuit that he wears throughout the Indigo disc, or at least the jacket anyway. I don't know if he wears the bottom half, but that is the reward that you get for being Drayton. So that is the other item of clothing that you can get within the Indigo disc. Now, just bear in mind, if you want to put the helmets on, if you have hair like my character or any big sort of hair, you can't put the helmets on. So you're going to have to Change your haircut before you can actually access the helmets. I had the issue with this, so just something to keep in mind. You can head back to any of the salons in Paldea and change your hair. You will have the new haircuts that are available through the Indigo Disc and obviously with the Teal Mask as well. So you can choose from an array of shorter styles so the helmet will fit on your head. But once you've done this, you're going to be able to see the black and gold tracksuit here. It looks really cool. One of my favorite new clothing items. I really like it that we're able to get this from Drayton. You're going to have the modified uniforms as well for the Team Star modified uniforms. They're more slouchy uniforms from the Academy back in Paldea. And you'll also get the Ghost sneakers as well as the Team Star heels and the replica Aethos shoes that you did buy from the auction house for a ridiculous amount of money the other items are going to be the team star gloves that you do get access to and the replica dragon gloves that you bought at the auction house the team star gloves are pure white and the replica dragon gloves that you get from the auction house are going to be these red ones here which look actually quite nice you're going to get the replica leader bag as well something that you also bought from the auction house you're also going to have access to the team star helmet now the replica expansion suit helmet which is this one here that you bought from the auction house the replica aqua suit helmet as well and the replica magma suit helmet as well as the ball guy helmet which is very cool because it's got a ball guy image on the back of it with the little cap on the top and i really like this one so these are kind of cool you get the team star sunglasses as well and of course, the replica ultra sunglasses to finish things off. So these are all available in the post game of the Indigo disc. Just make sure you've got a lot of money. You'll have to do the side quest in the academy before you do the side quest as well. Just make sure that you have done all of the penny quests inside the school. If you haven't complete all the penny quests yet. You're not going to be able to initiate the team star side quest to get these clothing items like we've shown you in today's video and then once you've done that you're able to get the gold and black tracksuit from drayton as well so you can rock that anywhere you are around the region so that is everything for today's video friends i hope you found it useful let me know down below which one of these items is your favorite and are these team star outfits a little bit too pricey will you be going for them or will you just give them a miss this time thank you so much for tuning in if you found it useful please drop a like on the video do subscribe to the channel to stay up to date with all of our pokemon scarlet and violet content and i will see you all in another video very soon so until then friends take care of yourselves and bye bye